Final Cut Pro 10 is really, really helpful when you utilize the organization features that are built in, specifically utilizing metadata. And in today's tip, I want to show you something really quick inside of the inspector. When you're in the info inspector, you have all of your different metadata visible here. You can go down to the bottom and click on, in this case, it says basic. Yours might say something different, but this little drop down menu lets you change the metadata view. So you can view, say, general information, which adds in things like real scene, and you can just click in these fields to add in information. But you can also go down and view more detailed information like EXIF information, which is data coming off of the camera and some more, more data that's, uh, some of your cameras may include this information, some of it may not. But the thing I wanna add in, or show you in this video is that you can add a custom metadata field. So instead of just going into the notes field and adding in all kinds of different notes and information to your clips, if you find that you're tagging clips specifically with certain information, go in and add custom metadata fields. This will make it easier for you to organize content down the road. And so for example, if I'm working on an animal documentary, I might have many different species or types of animals. So I could go in here and add a custom metadata field. I get the name and description. So I'm just gonna call it, and then let's call it, call it the animal type. It's fine, you can put in really anything you want here for name and description. And then once you do that and hit okay, you'll then see in the inspector, we now have an animal field. And in this case, it's a dog. So I've typed in dog for that animal, but you could type in anything you want. And then that data is not only attached to the clips, but it's searchable as well. So instead of just having a note that just goes on and on and on with all kinds of different information, you can create these custom metadata fields. You can then go in under general and you can create a custom metadata view. So I'm gonna go down to edit metadata view. And I can see on the left column, I have all the different views. Um, you can go down to the lower left here and say you wanna add a custom metadata field like we did. But in this case, I'm gonna add a new view. And this is gonna be for my animal doc, my animal documentary. So then for my animal documentary, I definitely want the animal field. And then if I wanted anything else, I could go down and check other fields as well. So maybe I also want the note field. So I'll look for notes and then hit OK. So now, in addition to the name of the clip, I can see that custom metadata view called animal, and then I see the notes as well. Which again, this is just one field, so maybe not too useful, because I could just write dog in the notes. But if you have characters and other specific data that's unique to your projects, creating those custom metadata fields can be very useful for searching and organizing your content. If you want to know, learn more, definitely subscribe to the channel. If there's a specific question you have, don't hesitate, leave it in the comments or send an email to finalcutprohelp at me.com.